My name is Maria Ornelas and I'm 64 years old. I've done quite a few things, but the majority of my uh, work was done in human resources. Um, my life growing up was, uh, was really joyful. I had um, two parent, loving parents. My dad loved my mom to death. We were at the park on the weekends, picnicking. We were visiting relatives in Sacramento. Religion was pretty important in our family when we were growing up. My mom and dad uh, were Advent churchgoers every Sunday. We were Catholic. Uh, if it was rosary time, we would all try to hide to see if we had to sit and do it. It was like torture for us. But uh, Wait, I think I was around 15 or 16 years old. Um, that I wasn't getting from religion what I, what I thought I was supposed to get from religion. When I got married, I um, was start. I had a very abusive uh, marriage, and so. I started blaming God for, and, and for the things that were happening to me because I couldn't understand it because what, why was He doing this to me? I didn't do anything wrong. I was a good person. I, I treated people well, but things were not going well for me in my life. And, uh, and um, so I started kind of not going to church anymore. Um, I didn't even pray, even the Our Father, the Hail Mary, I didn't do that anymore. I think it was a turning point for me. Uh, when my dad was first um, admitted to the hospital, I didn't get to see him. I, didn't, I, saw, I took him to the hospital, but I didn't get to see him after that. Uh, and I, I needed something or someone or something to, to make me feel good. I struggled with anxiety uh, and uh, because I didn't have something to, to make me feel that there was hope at the end of the tunnel, as they call. I, had a, I have a sister who's gone through so many surgeries and she's had brain surgery, she's had cancer, she's had all of this, and she was still joyful. And I would say, what is driving her? And uh, she said to me, she goes, God. And I said, well, a relationship with God. She, well, how do you have the relationship with God? What is it? What is having a relationship with God? We, I had to change my perception of who God was. And uh, when they said to me, God is love, and I said, God is love, and God is good, and, I'll, and, and, I'll, and I was like, wait a minute, that's not how I've seen Him all my life. How do I get to this point where I believe that? The first step, I think, that helped me in the journey was starting to do the studies and then um, being baptized. Uh, that was a decision that was very difficult for me to say, I want to get baptized. And the reason why it's difficult is because there was a time uh, as I was studying that I kept questioning myself, am I, uh, am I, is my dad going to be disappointed in me because he was Catholic? I, I had to, I made that decision to say, I'm not, I'm not betraying my dad. This is not, on the contrary, I'm probably honoring him by getting closer to, to Jesus. Um, if there were times that I took two steps forward and one step back, but I always saw the light that at the end of the tunnel that, that I was going to be okay. And so it just became so casual that I would, you know, say in the morning, Jesus, just walk with me today.